restoration or compensation, and I'll explain. Our rights to use the land we own. Our property rights are enshrined in our constitution and ought to give us the security to invest and to create livelihoods from our properties. Starting with the Liberal Nationals federally in 1996, successive Labor and LNP state and federal governments have gradually and in calculated ways bypassed the federal constitution to erode those light rights. After decades of stealth, our productive capacity is now gutted. Vegetation management laws that the Howard government drove and Beattie government started and successive governments have tightened. The noose around farmers. Farmers' rights to use the land, the vegetation, the water, the assets and the stock they bought have been smashed. This overreach means farming is now nationalised and bureaucrats control farm businesses. This is destroying farmers' ability to earn a living. And it's based on lies from government-funded academics that drive Labor's reef regulations and they impose onerous and unfounded restrictions on farming. The recent Senate inquiry in Brisbane showed that the science simply does not support these debilitating laws from Labor and that the LNP won't repeal. Across all sectors, farmers are branded as criminals. One Nation will repeal the vegetation management and reef regulations and similar laws gutting farming, forestry and fishing. We will fight for an Office of Scientific Integrity and Quality Assurance to ensure rigorous science for all policies. One Nation will fight to restore farmers' constitutional property rights and restoration or compensation. Farmers will return to productive livelihoods to feed and clothe us all with affordable Australian-made products. One Nation will free farming from the onerous and unfounded burdens of successive Labor and LNP governments because we know that the owner of the land is the best custodian of the land.